Volcanoes are openings or vents in the Earth's crust that allow hot molten rock magma, ash, and gas to escape. The word volcano comes from the Roman god Vulcan, the god of fire. There are three main types of volcanoes, cinder cones, shield volcanoes, and composite volcanoes. Dot, dot. Shield volcanoes are broad, gently sloping volcanoes that are built up from the slow eruption of fluid lava. Dot, dot. Composite volcanoes are the most common type of volcano. They are formed from alternating layers of ash, lava, and cinders. The most active volcano in the world is Kilauea in Hawaii. It has been erupting continuously since 1983. Volcanoes can have a devastating impact on people and the environment. Volcanic eruptions can cause tsunamis, earthquakes, mudflows, and ash clouds. Volcanic ash can damage crops, contaminate water supplies, and cause respiratory problems. About 80% of the Earth's surface is volcanic in origin. Volcanoes are responsible for about 75% of the world's gold and copper deposits. Geothermal energy from volcanoes is used to generate electricity in many countries. Volcanoes can create new land. For example, the Hawaiian Islands were formed by volcanic eruptions. Volcanoes can also have a positive impact on the environment. For example, they can help regulate the Earth's climate. Crater lakes. These lakes form in the depressions left behind by explosive volcanic eruptions. The crater walls act as a natural dam, holding in the water that collects from rain, snowmelt, and groundwater. Crater lakes can be found all over the world, and they vary in size from small ponds to large lakes. Some famous crater lakes include Lake Toba in Indonesia, Crater Lake in Oregon, and Tall Lake in the Philippines. Caldera Lakes Calderas are much larger than craters, and they are formed by the collapse of a volcano summit after a large eruption. Caldera Lakes can be enormous, and they can hold vast amounts of water. Some of the world's largest lakes are Caldera Lakes, including Lake Topo in New Zealand, Lake Crater in Oregon, and Lake Toba in Indonesia. Oxbow Lakes these lakes are formed when a river bends around a piece of land and then cuts off a new channel. The old channel is left behind as an oxbow lake. Oxbow lakes are common in many parts of the world, especially in meandering rivers.